Romance during the pandemic has been tricky to say the very least, especially with Valentine's Day around the corner. Our next guest is an expert in the romance department, and he has some tips and treats to help make sure this holiday is that has that romantic spark for you and your sweetheart. Valentine's Day is all about romance for the ones we love. For some tips on how to make that special person in your life feel special this holiday, we turn to someone who knows a thing or two about what it takes to be romantic. Former bachelor and bachelorette contestant, Bob Guinea. Bob, I mean, just by the looks of you, everything looks pretty romantic to start. <laughs> Not bad, right? I mean, you know, I, I would love to take credit for all of this, but you know, I had nothing to do with it, but thank you. Yeah, very romantic. And you know, life can get really hectic. So I wanted to provide a little of my favorite romantic and easy ideas for Valentine's Day. So first and foremost, even if you're not celebrating with anyone else, you can even be celebrating by yourself here, make your Valentine something delicious to eat and drink. And many of us are staying in to celebrate. I like to make the Rose of Palm cocktail. It's a unique burst of flavor, antioxidant goodness, palm, wonderful 100% pomegranate juice. Palm juice adds a festive ruby red pop of color, a delicious sweet yet tart flavor to any dish or cocktail. And then check these out. These are the ruby red palm bars. They will not disappoint. They are so delicious. It's got like a shortbread crust Ooh. on the bottom. It's so good. A little powdered sugar. Even better, each 16 ounce bottle contains the juice of four whole pressed pomegranates and nothing else. No sugar, no added sugar, no fillers, no preservatives. So it's awesome. I mean, there is no better way to be romantic with yourself or with a partner than thinking about being healthy, which I co sign. I love that. Yeah. Thank I you. Love, Thank you. And yeah. I love and I love that palm is so versatile. With the, with the cookie. But Bob, how can we, you know, a lot of people I know say, oh, Valentine's Day is just another day that I'm gonna break the bank. How can we do this without breaking the bank? Well, that, exactly. I think, I think it's important not to break the bank, right? Being responsible can still be sexy. It can still be romantic. And, and I love, I mean, flowers are a great choice for Valentine's Day. I love sending them to myself once in a while to make, make myself think I have an admirer out there. Oh, look at you! Uh, <laughs> these, these are just bouquets. These are so great. They're part of Teleflora's best-selling Valentine's Day lineup. Precious in Pink bouquet and the Sophisticated Love bouquet. Both feature a beautiful mix of pink, red, and white fresh flowers with some greenery in there. They're beautifully curated arrangements, ready to enjoy the moment they arrive. And here's the big key. Always hand-delivered by a local florist. So people think Teleflora is this company based out of somewhere crazy. It's, it's actually someone who looks uh, to make sure that local florists are still involved. They always include a stylish container that can be incorporated into your home for years to come too. So they're beautiful to look at and they're really great to actually have and smell and you know, they bring the senses alive, I like to say. I love that, I love it. So what are some of the surprises that we can give our loved ones to, to delight and wow them? Well, I will tell you, this is what my wife's getting for Valentine's Day. So if she's watching, surprise, <laughs> we're going out. You still, why not dress up? You know, why not make yourself feel good on that day? So do something that makes you feel good. The Gimme Beauty Freedom Curling Iron gives you wireless freedom to do touch-ups and styling wherever life may take you. The titanium barrel, I've been told, is wonderful for evenly distributed heat, which means smooth, soft, romantic curls, which are perfect for date night. And it's got the longest lasting battery life for up to 45 minutes of styling. So you can plug it in, you can continue to use while it's charging, but then you can throw it in your purse, your suitcase, and you can take it with you on the goal and go and use it wherever you're at. You can use the, co the code VDAYCURLS30 to get 30% off right now. So it's a smart way to give a gift. You're actually saving some money and doing it, uh, but you're giving a gift that someone can use no matter where they're at. They don't have to just be near an outlet. They can use it wherever they need it. Well, as someone who has hair or more hair than you and uses a curling iron, I need that. That's yeah. going to be the gift I give myself. So thank you. This is the I, one. It's beautiful. And you can actually, you can use it. And then it has like a titanium sleeve that you throw it in and you can literally it can be hot and you're using it. And then you put it in your bag. You're fine. Don't Genius. have to worry about it. Cool. Genius. Without worrying that you're going to put a hole, send you a hole in your bag. This, right. uh, <laughs> there is no end. There's no end to this stuff you can do. It. It's unbelievable. All right. Can we get back to sugary treats for a second? Because yeah, yeah. sugar, Valentine's Day, a little synonymous, but what can we do for our loved ones so that they can enjoy the sweet but not diminish their smile? Great question, and thank you for asking. You know, as people indulge with the sugary chocolates and everything else that come along with Valentine's Day, United Healthcare Dental wants to remind the members to focus on dental health before and after Valentine's Day. And I actually told my son this this morning. I said, that means brushing in the morning, brushing at night for a full two minutes, flossing daily, which is a tough lesson to teach but it's important and getting those twice yearly cleanings which are typically covered by your dental plan. 
Also included with many of the plans are virtual dental visits. You can get 24 seven advice from a licensed dentist and help avoid potentially unnecessary trips to the ER for toothaches that turn into something even worse. Yeah. So it's a really great way to make sure even around Valentine's Day when you know you're having some sweets that you're taking care of the pearly whites so the people that have to look at them still think you look lovely. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing sexier than a, than a nice smile. I, I agree. That's the truth. So my Bob, mom always used to say, you know, my mom used to tell my sister all the time, nothing's prettier than someone who's smiling. And I always, I always listen to that. Yeah, I thought I'm, that was a nice thing. I love that. And you have some nice chompers too. I like it. Ah, right back at you, Marisol. Thank you. I try. I'll tell you what, I love going to the dentist. I choose going to the dentist over getting a pedicure. Just tween us girls. Oh, Don't. that's <laughs> awesome. I love Just between it. Let's, Just let's between get us. it. Yes. <laughs> Bob, where can folks go to get more information on all this wonderful stuff? All you got to do, you go to dailylounge.com and you can find out everything we talked about today and more. Fantastic. Always great to see you. Happy Valentine's Day to you and your wife and your family. Thank you, my friend. Happy Valentine's Day to you too. And hopefully I'll see you soon.